So we don't have to introduce the firm. Uh, and then we'll move on to something else. As, as Carol mentioned, the firm was founded in 1936, uh, initially by uh, Lewis Kidmore and, and Nat Owings. And in, in 1969, uh, going on his fourth decade of practice, uh, Nat Owings wrote a book uh, called The American Aesthetic. And The American Aesthetic uh, reflected Nat's uh, lifelong passion for the environment and the design uh, to reflect incorporation of the, the man-made built environment within the natural environment and a study of how uh, the man-made environment within cities uh, can either enrich or harm our environment. Uh, that was, was uh, certainly influenced by uh, Rachel Carson's Side of Spring. Uh, it had a very, very meaningful uh, impact on his work. Uh, and that literally took the 30,000-foot uh, view of the world. Uh, he took that view in his book uh, by, by photographing uh, aerial views of the environment, both the man-made environment and the natural environment, uh, and studied that. And you can see the quote, I won't get to read the quote, but this is how Nat opened the book. Uh, this is how he believed that the successful integration of the natural and the built environment is a true measure of architecture. And it's important to achieve that integration to meet the ever-changing needs of our growing society. Uh, of equal importance was the fact that that believed in architecture and engineering as a practice, uh, not merely as a theoretical study. And the, the concept of a partnership, a multidisciplinary partnership as a practice was integral to Nat's thinking. And it is that practice of SLM, that partnership of, uh, of architects of uh, structural engineers, mechanical engineers, civil engineers, urban designers, uh, interior architects, uh, all working together that created our practice. And this is the practice of sustainability. It is through this lens of practice uh, that we'd like to share with me this evening some of the history of uh, SLM's uh, environmentally conscious work, and then three projects uh, that we'll be looking at this evening. 